This week's Rule in Spotlight takes us to Talmadge City Schools where there's nothing better as a corporation to say that we have repeat customers and we've really enjoyed our, our time working with Talmadge City Schools, especially to be back. And we're here with Paul Supalak, our project manager on the site. Paul, tell us a little bit about what we're doing out here for Talmadge City Schools. Okay, thanks Ben. Uh, design started in 2017 for this site. Uh, the project consists of a new middle school that's at 78,000 square feet. Uh, it also consists of an elementary school that allows for the district to consolidate all their their uh, pre-K through five uh, grade levels. And this is 110,000 square feet. What do you say we go inside, talk to our superintendent, Mr. Huff, and we take a look at some design components from Sol Harris Day in this building? Sure, let's go. We're inside now with Superintendent Tom Huff. Tom, tell us a little bit about how things are going. Uh, it's going well under circumstances. We've got the punch list going. Uh, very close to completion on that. The teachers have been able to get in here and bring all the material. The district's moved in. They do have some upcoming days where they can actually unpack and prepare for next school year. Uh, it's been a great experience working with Soul, Hor Soul Harris Day on their concept, making that a reality, working with them with that. I'd like to go around and uh, show you some of the unique features of the building. So here we are in the second grade pod. Uh, some of the design elements, we have a large open space, no corridors really in this building, no, no major corridors. Uh, this allows for a lot more flexible learning space. As you get into the individual studios or classrooms, you can see there's these overhead sectional doors. Uh, this allows for the teachers to really work and uh, work collaboratively and kind of merge the classes, working dynamically with each other for their lessons. And that's proof in the pudding that these teachers were moving in during this crisis right here. Let's go to the next section. What we have here is one of the great collaboration areas of the building. Uh, it's collaboration stairs as we call it. And I've got a couple other breakout areas you can see behind me here, a group room and a little breakout session for the children that can read, such as that, but another great feature of the building. Paul, Tom, thank you for the tour of the building. Great job. We are ruling, we are safe, and we are essential. <laughs>